show some snow lying about. What a wonderful big tree. Houston. Kirk. What a wonderful bike. Could do with a bit of a clean, but nevertheless. Last couple of times I've come here, the church has been closed, sadly. And here's me thinking God was open seven days a week. Not in this modern era, I'm afraid. I think he's open for only an hour a week. Oh, hello, buddy. Houston House. Some parts of it they say date back to as far back as the 16th century. Most of it being built in the 1800s by, by hard grafting labourers designed by David Thompson and bits and bobs added here and there towards the late 1800s. I think part of it, last time I was here, was a couple of years ago, it had been converted into apartments um, but it's quite quite the Victorian swagger but a gothic baronial what have you chucked in for good measure but uh, a quite little idyll indeed and some wonderful big trees and all that horrible horrible this growth at the bottom of the trees Wonderful. Another quiet little corner in the greater Glasgow scene. And uh, well worth a visit. We're going to continue down. Past St Peter's Well, make a wish. On to on to Barscube Hill, cross the main road into the bucolic lanes of Renfrewshire, and and then on to Barscube Hill, and uh, we'll get the train back from Langham. If you even get their their own colour coded cones here. Must be a special place.